Because, I mean, you had these, you know, these presidential debates, and especially the Republican ones, where I swear I heard 9-11 more times than I think I might have heard it in 2002 or 2003. But, you know, again, Corey brings up the point of this, I, not a, there's a new audience of people that, <clears throat> you know, again, 9-11, what's 9-11? I, I, I don't know what that is. I, let me go online and figure out what happened on that date. So there's automatically going to be a large percentage of people that for, you know, loose change might be their first impression of what happened on September 11th, which, you know, some people might say is a good thing, some people might say is a bad thing. But um, it's, it's interesting to be living in a world where 9-11 is still used as a justification, but there's people that are alive that have no idea what it means and don't know why the country that they were born into is in this position um, about this event that they weren't alive for. I don't and, know. And furthermore, kind of on top of that, you have, you have people who are so adamantly against any kind of ulterior version of the events that they become those keyboard warriors and they slam people for trying to talk about it when they actually themselves know so little about these events and, and the fact that the family members are the ones that requested the initial investigation into 9-11, which led to the congressional inquiry, which led to the 9-11 commission report, which we still don't have answers for and we still have redacted pages for, and they get mad at us saying we're disrespecting the family members and they know so little that they don't know that the family members are the ones that actually were the ones that caused the initial 9-11 investigation in the first place, which is an interesting I irony for me to just be yelled at by people that know so little about something that they're yelling at me for doing the exact thing that I've set out to do. It's, it's a little confusing. People who are actually disrespecting the family members telling us that we're disrespecting the family members like, mm, okay, you, you know, live in your little world and we'll live in ours and that'll be that.